Please rise for a moment of silence to be followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, BHS. I'm Emily. And I'm Addie. And welcome, welcome to Bash, Bash TV. Today is Wednesday, November 2nd, making today the official 40th day of school and day two of the cycle. Students who signed up to take the ASVAB this Thursday should report to room 45 immediately after homeroom. The guidance office will hold an additional FAFSA nights on November 9th and 5 p.m. and 5.30 p.m. and November 10th for at 4.30 p.m. and 5 p.m. for anyone who is unable to attend the first session. Appointments are required. Sign up in the guidance office. Here are some announcements for seniors. Graduation project presentations will take place on November 9th and 10th, beginning at 3 p.m. Presentation time schedules are located in the hallways throughout the building. It is your responsibility to check the schedule and be on time for your presentation. Seniors, please check the list outside of Mrs. Eisenberg's room to see if your dues are paid in full yet. All names on the list qualify to receive the yearbook discount. The last day to take advantage of the yearbook discount is December 2nd, 2022. On November 4th at 10.30 a.m., all seniors will report to the auditorium to order their cap, gown, and tassel for graduation. There will be a debate club meeting in Mr. Gottam's room Thursday, November 3rd at 2.40 p.m. All interested students are welcome to join. There will be a show meeting in the library on Friday, November 4th at 7.30 a.m. or 2.40 p.m. Juniors and seniors, Luzerne County Community College will have a representative here on November 2nd at 9.30 a.m. to speak with interested students. Please sign up in the guidance office. LCC will also hold an open house on Saturday from 9.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. at the main campus in Nanticoke. Students and parents can meet with faculty, learn about financial aid, and tour the campus. A complimentary breakfast will be served from 9.30 a.m. to 10 p.m. a.m. Well, that's it for Main Desk. Now let's send it over to Sports with Sean. Thanks, Addie and Emily. I'm Sean. Hydration testing for football players and anyone planning to wrestle this season will be held today at 2 p.m. Testing will be in the trainer's room at the middle school. They will work as fast as possible to get everyone to football practice on time. Even if you are unsure if you will wrestle, you should complete hydro testing. They are on a time limit for entering hydration results. Any student in grades 9 through 12 interested in playing softball this year, please stop by Coach Johnson's room 35 to sign up. More information will be given in the coming weeks. The 64th Annual School Boy Race will be held on Saturday, November 19th, beginning at 10 a.m. Registration forms are available in the guidance office. On Monday in sports, the girls' volleyball team swept Pittston in three sets to advance to the district championship. CeCe Eisenberg finished with 19 kills and 7 digs. Sarah Stieber added 7 kills, 4 aces, 15 service points, and 8 digs. And Morgan Neville had 6 aces, 15 service points, and 32 assists. The dogs face off against Dallas tomorrow at Penn State Wilkes-Barre where they will get the chance to 3P for the district championship. Now let's check out today's birthdays. Happy birthday to Wesley Figueroa, Caitlin Roberts, Kylie Smith, and Michael Vaughn. That's it for Bash TV. Have a great day, BHS.